Hi guys, welcome back to my video. This week we went to Walmart for a grocery haul, needed a couple of personal care items from there, so just decided to go there for our grocery haul. Let me show you everything I ended up getting. We got a bunch of cheeses because we're gonna be making a bunch of different dishes and we have some company coming, so I just needed to replace what we're gonna be using. So we have Fiesta blend cheese, extra sharp cheddar cheese, Parmesan cheese for our Italian dishes, some mozzarella cheese, so when we make pizzas and, and some Italian dishes. I got my almond milk unsweetened there since we were already there. And I got all purpose um, flour. We were restocking our flour with our last bag, so I thought I'd get another one because we use flour for everything, baking, um, breads and cookies, making um, pancakes sometimes, waffles, you name it. So I had to get more of that. Then I got some more of the unsalted chicken broth. I ended up getting a couple of things for my, you know, extra cash. I spend like up to $20 sometimes on things just to stock my pantry so that we don't ever run out. So I bought the unsalted chicken broth. I really like these when we cooked with them. They're way cheaper than the one I used to get. So we love that and they actually taste good. And there's only 45 milligrams of sodium in this. So very good. Got some elbow macaroni, I bought three of them because we were all out, so I needed to replace that. Some Hellman's, this is on a rollback at $4.88 at Walmart. I have a dollar back from Ibotta, so making it three eighty eight, which is pretty much like what we used to pay for it before price went crazy and high. So this was a good deal. We use Manny so much that I don't mind buying that and having it in stock for the future. And the dates on that are good for quite some time. Then I bought some Parmesan cheese. We've tried Aldi's Parmesan cheese in Romano. We've tried Walmart's, and I unfortunately only like the Kraft ones, so we went back to this. So I have to get more of them because I'm running low on our Parmesan cheese. Then we ended up getting some more bacon bits because I already opened what we had. So I want to put this back for the future. For We use that sometimes in our potato soups, baked potatoes, our, our loaded mashed potatoes, our twice-baked potatoes. Um, I put them on eggs, you name it. It's This is such a great thing to have because you don't always need to make a huge thing of bacon up, so that's worth it to have in the pantry. Got Fruity Pebbles. We ended up getting this big bag because it was a lot cheaper to get this big bag, and my son only has his Cheerios left, so this is perfect to add to our pantry for him. Then I stocked up on his, excuse me, on his um, Chick-fil-A again because we had, we have one in up here, I just needed one more for our backup because um, he really likes that on his, a lot of different things, french fries and nuggets. So wanted to get that in stock for him. Bought the Cheeto puffs for him because he did not like my dollar store um, Cheeto balls. I mean, not Cheeto balls, cheese balls. So I'll eat them and these are for him because they still don't have the round balls for Cheetos either. Then I got some Tostito light salted. Um, for my dip with salsa, and sometimes I put this with my chili dishes and stuff, so needed that to have. And I also have um, some salsa to serve that with, like I said. And then I have pepperoni. This is nice to have in the pantry because I like to put this on with pizza. Sometimes we put it on um, the, uh, what are these, tortillas. We make homemade little snack pizzas, and sometimes he even puts this in, excuse me, my finger got in the way there, and he sometimes puts these in um, like little, uh, like an egg roll almost, but for for pizza. So they, they're, they're really good. They like to use these in a lot of different things. And then we also bought Tostito dip for the Tostitos. My husband had, hadn't had this in a while, so I picked that up for him. The spicy nachos, because we really like the Doritos, the spicy ones, better than the original. So we got another bag of those. Some Dr. Pepper Cherry Zero. We haven't picked that up in a while, so he picked that up while we were shopping. And then we got this big thing of Greek yogurt because they didn't have my small ones, and my dog is eating Greek yogurt. I eat Greek yogurt. We cook with it, so this should be fine. It should last a while, especially the expiration date's far out. Got my son his strawberry banana yogurt. Got some block cheeses because we like to have these with our... Um, crudite and um, cheese platter we make. So I got him the mutts, extra sh sharp cheddar and pepper jack, we like these. So got some more of those to have in the house. Got some plantains, we like to fry tostones, so we got them. Some cilantro because I was running low on my sofrito, so I bought this and they haven't had the 
cilantro in a while, which I should have bought more of, but I'll go back next time. Got my red pepper and green pepper to do the sofrito with. And then I got some mushrooms because we're going to have some steak with mushrooms. My son loves mushrooms, so he requested them. Got a family bag of this sweet and salty Chex Mix. My husband likes this stuff. Bought some pretzels from Walmart because they have, um, they had a, I had a coupon from the the mail, which was a dollar off from the newspaper. Then I have a 75 cent back for my bada. So I thought, let's give that a try because we love pretzels. Then we bought some more sausage, egg and cheese sandwiches for my son um, just to have in because he finished the last one today. We got some cray crayon raisins to go into a mix that we're gonna make um, since I have a whole bunch of, you know, Walmarts, Walmarts not here, <laughs> Walmarts, a whole bunch, whole bunch of um, walnuts. I wanted to take them and my half pecans and make our own blend for my husband because he loves nut blends. So I bought him some banana chips to go in there. So this is for his sweet. And then some almonds since we already have um, the unsalted cashews, um, oh, what are the other things called? Hazelnuts, half pecans, walnuts, and macadamia nuts. So we got that for him for a treat to have for work. And then sweet corn bread, he wanted to try this because he's really trying to find a really good sweet corn, corn um, muffin mix. And so far we have not found anyone we really love. So we do like this brand for um, dessert that we make. So maybe this will be the winner. Then got him some more, um, drinks cause he was all out of his, uh, zero vitamin water. So we got him the orange and the shine ones that he likes. I got some more Goya rice cause we're down to one bag left of that. So I wanted to restock on that. So that's going in my pantry. Since I refilled my rice container, I needed to do that. Got some more sausage cause we're running low on them. Got a thing of Oreo double stuff for my son, as well as the Milano's. Actually, I like these too. My husband's not a big Oreo golden one. He likes the chocolate ones, but we got them anyway. And then I got the milk chocolate Milano's and then their favorite Frosted Devil food cake um, donuts by Entenmann's. They're yummy. Got some more cheese. This was really good. We like this with... Um, what is it called? Uh, grilled cheese. We love this on the burgers. It's a very good cheese for um, deli, slice, like a deli slice almost, but it's in the um, section where you pick up your sliced cheeses, which was great. So very, very good. Um, some bread for our Wagyu beef burgers. So I'm looking forward to that. Got some more nuggets for my son because he's running low on them. So he loves the taste of these and so do I. Hash browns, um, we needed more of these because we've been making a bunch of different potato dishes and so we needed more of that. I got two bags of that and um, a bag of these famous seasoned fries from Checkers. We used to love Checkers from back up in Jersey. They had a restaurant there that um, they would serve these awesome cheesy uh, chili fries. So we picked them up to try, hopefully we like them. Got some Ilio's pizza for my husband and son, they like that. And then for the non-food items, I needed some hair ties. So I got two different ones. This is the one I normally get from Goody. So we tried, I'm trying these because they look really cute, the color brown. And then I got these to tie my hair back at night because I'm tired of wearing a plastic, not plastic, but stretchy. They pull my hair out. So I'm going to see if this helps keep me from having the hair in my face. But I'm going to make you laugh. I kind of have a bit of a big head. So I don't know if these will be comfortable to sleep with. So I'll give it a try and hopefully... I won't have to give it away, but we'll see. They feel stretchy, so hopefully they'll do the job. Then I got some steak burgers, um, Famous Dave's Steak and Burgers. So we wanted to try this since we're having steak and burgers this week. My husband's all about the seasonings, so we bought that today. I saw this huge thing of Heritage hair shampoo. I love, love, love this shampoo. It smells phenomenal. If you've never used this product, they do a hairline that's catered to every hair um, start every hair uh, texture that you could imagine. Uh, so you have to go check them out. I, I absolutely love them. I found them on um, Instagram and YouTube and they're, they're just a beautiful family in general that owns this company, but also their story and their their family is just such a beautiful family. I love this product. So when I saw this huge um, 21 fluid ounce bottle, I picked it up because the smaller bottle was $9 and this was only almost 12 so I picked this up, so now I'm good for quite some time. 
needed some more measuring spoons because I keep breaking them. I don't know. I become like the Hulk and crash things when I'm cooking. So I needed um, a new set, to, some of these to go into some of my containers so that I'm not always looking for a measuring cup. And plus, I love that they get to hang. So I hang them for my kitchen um, counter thing that I have here. So I like the Pioneer colors. So I got that one. My husband has um, requested silverware to bring to work he doesn't want throwaway silver he wants something he washed so we're gonna give these flatware set a try he was looking more for a metal one but they didn't have it so he's gonna try this out so we got that some more toothpicks because these are really cute and they they don't fall out and all over the place so we got more of them to have in the house i bought this little set here from the pioneer woman it's um got all of these items in it and my my silicone whisk broke and my um, what are they called? Spoonulas and stuff are getting a little yucky. So I wanted to toss them and replace them with this. And I really, really wanted to use these two items because I see so many people cooking with them and how much they love cooking with them. And it's easy to, you know, prepare dinners with. So I wanted to give these wooden, um, I think they're called spurtles a try. Um, I've seen it on Amy, Amy, um, Marianne's channel. And I want to say, Oh, I can't remember. I'll tag you on the channels that I watch that use these. And they're just, they're such great product. I just thought, let me give them a try. So we got that. And then um, Snuggle. These were um, $1.97 in the store. I got two of them. I have a um, $1.50 coupon back for both of them. So they only made each of these 40 something cents, which is a steal. So got them because I needed to stock up on some more um, of my what is this called fabric sheets so that was a good deal this was an amazing deal two dollars for the germex hand sanitizer we love 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 this brand and the scent so we bought this because we can squeeze this into our our um hand sanitizer things we have for the car so this is perfect so i got two of them that's all they had there so i got for four bucks i mean these a little thing costs almost close to three something a piece so this was a really good deal got 40 count of great value flexible unscented bags because we needed these for our trash and then heavy duty scrubbers for my um, cast irons these are great they get everything off and clean them really nice and then we ended up getting these socks for my son he is into Spider-Man and now recently into this anime that he's been watching with his father and his brother, older brother, really enjoys. So I thought I'd surprise him with some socks because he's been wearing summer socks. I'm like, why didn't you tell me you, your other socks you outgrew? I would have bought him more for Christmas. I only bought him one pack of Dragon Ball Z for Christmas because I thought he had enough socks. But So we are donating the things that he has and he's outgrown and we're going to replace them with this. But that's pretty much it. Everything we ended up getting at Walmart. Nothing too crazy. A lot of fill-in stuff. A lot of snacking and, and some pantry items that I was running low on that we needed. And some things we just bought in bulk because it was just easier. And the price, like I said, the eggs were amazing. So that is it for our Walmart haul. Hope you have a great day. Thank you for following me. If you haven't already, hit that like, subscribe, and notification bell. And see you in the next one. Bye.